Hello viewers, PNK94 here. Welcome back to the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Last time we found out that Thunder Dragon in our time is dead. And in his time, he is sick, which is like a thousand years, is that what was implied? Something like that. I, I think I, I don't know if that was ever said, but I usually just go by that. It's because the Moldorak was like a thousand year old arachnid or something like that. I don't actually fully remember, but it was something like that. Anyway, we need to go take this seed for the tree of life that we got to a place where it will grow and flourish. So, we are going to the sealed grounds. Don't judge me, I have to check with Goko each time. I must know these things. Okay, he... Oh, no, he's not holding me a snap. <gasps> oh my god! Hi, Goko. Lost writings in an ancient text. What secrets could have been written there? Layers upon layers of mysteries. By the way, would you like to review what was written in the text? Please. Mm. The three uncles, the trites, and... The text is too badly damaged to read it all beyond that point. What do you suppose it could say? I know exactly what it says, Gorko. I know exactly what it says. It is that which I have been tasked to find to save the world. The Trifork. Wait, shit. That's not it. Oh man, this is a terrible Triforce. Oh god. Please work. Yeah! Holy Goron! So this is what the last, last part of the old text was explaining. Nice going, bud. Oh. Now I have seen everything that those ancient writings described. I really owe you, bud. So let me give you this. Just my way of saying thanks. You got a gold rupee! It's worth a staggering 300 rupees. Yay! Thanks, Gorkel. All right, let me actually grab one of these fairies. <laughs> Let's grab all three, just in case. Got it. All right. I said all three, but let me rephrase that. Fill up my third bottle as well, because I already had a fairy in the other one, so that one can heal me. All right. Thanks, Gorko. Thanks a lot, dude. You said I haven't gone down in a while. Last time I did was against the imprisoned, because I didn't realize I was supposed to stun him and stuff. Because every other time before that, which was actually only once, all I had to do was punch him. Alright, so if you remember last time we were here, look, that is a place where we could potentially put something. Cause didn't Gru say something about, like, trees or whatever? So, let's go back to the past. And we're going to change history. <laughs> Hello, Impa. I am back. And you are here. Right, uh, that's this side. Is everything like reversed here? Or am I just... No, it's just we come out the opposite side of the thing. Okay. There we go. We'll just check on that in about a thousand years. Actually, yeah, they did like specifically say a thousand years difference, didn't they? Yeah. So unlike with the time shift stone, I actually know exactly like with the time shift stones. I don't know, time travel in this game is very confusing. We're not even gonna go into that. <sighs> Look, Groose, I did it! I did it, I planted a tree. <laughs> oh yeah, now this is a tree I could look at all day. It's like a symbol for this temple or something. Every time I stare at it, my jaw starts hanging open and I get this weird happy feeling. So yeah, Gruus is talking all like that wasn't here this whole time. Interesting. This other stuff that we do seems to work just fine. Where it's like that very clearly just changed before our eyes somehow. It's... it's... <sighs> Even the second one fruit of legend cures any illness. Take it to the Thunder Dragon. Indeed we shall. Hey, imprisoned, you want to show up again? That's what I fucking thought. Seriously, those two times so close to each other, that was kind of ridiculous. <laughs> let's be honest here. Alright, let's get back to the bird statue. And I'll meet you guys 
back at the Gorka. Do you say anything else now that we've done all that? Like anything else you want to share? Over time, the power of the Goddess Falls is restored. When that happened, they're like, hell with my research again. Wait, but I already helped you with every. I'm not sure what else he's gonna want. Um, maybe I'll check back later? No real reason to, because the final reward is supposed to be that rupee, so I don't know what else he'd... I don't know, maybe, maybe, maybe you can just keep doing that for treasures or something like he was giving you before, I'm not actually sure. But yeah, that that is why you wanted to keep helping with his research, because you get 300 rupees. Which is, not, it just, it's nice right now, but very shortly, it's not going to be as nice. Anyway, before we actually return to the Thunder Dragon, there's one more thing I would like to grab. I'll meet you guys inside the Thunderhead. Alright, if we go back to that one island that we last got a goddess chest on, I'm sure you guys will remember that, it was only a couple episodes ago. If you remember, we found another one that was not active. And I explored the other direction. So, obviously, that is going to be our final goddess chest. Figured we might as well grab it while we're in the sky. Let's try to avoid this guy. So instead of going to the right, if we go to the left, we're gonna get in my way. Okay, good. This way, and you. I wonder, like, if you kill that guy, if he would stay gone. I actually have no idea about that. Anyway, in our final goddess chest, must be something awesome, right? <gasps> eh. Not really. Not really. I mean, now you can hold a bunch of extra arrows if you had two of those in your inventory, but it's kind of underwhelming for how long it took to get to this point. But whatever, man. I'm, I always like having more arrows. Yeah, okay, bye. Oh, you're still following me. Yeah. Alright. Now that we have every single goddess chest, I'll meet you guys back at the Thunder Dragon. I'm gonna drop back down to the Nehru Gorge. Thunder Dragon, I'm about to save your life. Okay, let's go this way. Right back over to, oh, wait a second, what am I doing? We already have the seed. You don't need to go back over there, I'm stupid, don't mind me. Alright. <clears throat> Hello, Thunder Dragon. We meet again. Oh, Axel. Hello there. Is there something you need? I forget what voice I did for him before. Oh god. Here you go! <laughs> Don't ask, don't ask where I was keeping this. Oh, oh, is that what I think it is? You brought that here for me, didn't you? Yep. <laughs> oh, down the hatch. That would have been hilarious if it only went like four feet or something. <laughs> Sing a ding ding! Um, ding a ding ding? <laughs> now somebody's happy. Oh, you've done it, boy. I can feel the fruit's effect surging through me. It's exhilarating. I feel like a proper dragon again. Yay! Can you teach me the song now? I need to, I need to go save the world. Mm. Just because I have eternal life doesn't mean I can't get mighty sick. Thanks to you, boy, this old dragon will keep on charging a while yet. I owe you a big thank you, so allow me to perform a moving rendition of my part of the Song of the Hero. I should warn you, I've got a mean set of pipes and I know how to use them. These, this'll clean out these, uh, uh, those ears, boys, so brace yourself. Okay. I owe you my life. You have to let me repay you. Give me some time to prepare, and when you next return to visit me, I believe you will be mightily pleased. Oh, 
Well done, Master. You've successfully collected three parts of the Song of the Hero. I recommend you return to the sky and meet with the great sky spirit, Levias, to complete the song. Oh, man. So, let me just, uh, test something here. I'm sure a thousand years is enough time for your right, Thunder Dragon. Um. Right. Thund Thunder Dragon. Thunder Dragon. Thunder Dragon. Thunder Dragon. I mean, his bones aren't here anymore, so he's not dead. Um, we'll just uh, we'll just leave that off for now. Okay, back to Levias we go. Yeah, in hindsight, we could have gotten that last goddess chest as we were going back to Levias. Want to save some time? Not um, Levias, can you like? Sh okay, get out of my way. Go away. Go away. Go away. Get away from me. I'm back! Hi! Hello! I am back. It's a good thing I apparently have a perfect memory when it comes to music, too. Or we'd be screwed. Ah, <laughs> so you've learned all three parts of the song from the dragons, eh? You have done well, young one. True to my word, I will perform the last part of the song for you. <clears throat> Part of the song of Bro. Hi. <laughs> Scared the shit out of me. The song of the hero is now complete! Now that you know the song, I trust you know what to do with it. That old song opens a door to a great trial. Should you succeed in conquering the challenge awaiting you there, I'm certain the path to the Triforce will be revealed to you. <sighs> Alright. Now where do I play this thing at? Okay, good. A report, Master. I have determined that there is a trial gate somewhere among these floating islands that can be opened by the Song of the Hero. I suggest you use your dowsing ability to locate it. Wait, trial gate? As in... Well, that's not right. Well, it's outside somewhere, in this direction. In this direction. In this direction. In this direction? Yeah. Well, that's the direction of Skyloft. What? I call shenanigans of some kind. Hmm. Well, let's get back to Skyloft then, shall we? I actually wonder if now that we just did that, if the Thunder Dragon's already ready for us. This is important, I need to check this real quick. Trust me. Just trust me. He's probably not, because we literally just left, but maybe now that we're in the present. <sighs> and not a thousand years in the past. Maybe, now that we've done that. we will be like, oh hey, it's been so long, where have you been? Oh, you time traveled? You son of a bitch. I don't know. That's probably the conversation I would have with Link if he did that to me. Yep. I mean, you know, going to all that trouble to prepare that thing, it's like, oh, 
you, you, you're actually in a thousand years in my future. I see. Well, screw you too, hero. Wait a thousand years for you to do my challenge? That's just rude. Spoilers, he has a challenge for us if he's ready. That's that that's what his um repayment is. Uh let's see. Alright, Thunder Dragon. Are we, are we good to go? Probably not, because I literally just left, but uh okay, he's not there. What if I do go back into the past? Okay. It's promising. Okay. Hello, Thunder Dragon. Is your challenge ready? Finally, Axel. You really did come back. Glad to see it. That's not the voice I was doing for you. Well then, let's have some fun. Maybe a hero such as yourself has no time for playing around. Well, what I offer is more than mere child's play. I would have you face challenges that draw upon the many hardships you've experienced thus far. Look to the past to understand the future. That's what I say. And I think you will find that you have much to gain in revisiting your own past. So what do you say, Axel? Maybe not this episode. What? You're not interested? How dull. Ah oh, well, come back any time you change your mind. I'll be waiting. So, next time on The Legend of... <coughs> Excuse me. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, we'll be taking the Thunder Dragon's Challenge. If you guys like this one to see more, make sure to let me know in the comments below. Be sure to like, consider subscribing, all that good stuff. Till next time, this is Pinky 94 Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.